Hey everybody, Heather from Hooked on Picking here. Sorry for the disheveled look. I'm doing some yard work today, but before I finish my day out, I definitely want to get all of my Poshmark shipped out for the day. So here we go, and here's what sold the last two days on Poshmark. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you my number for my earnings. That's not how much the item sold for, so don't be discouraged with the low number amounts you hear from me because that's what I earned, not necessarily what it sold for. So, for example, this first item is a leopard print mini dress. It sold for $10, but my earnings were $5.25. I paid $2 for it, so I'm going to put $3.25 on the board because that's actual profit. So my earnings were $5.25, then I took off the two that I paid for it to purchase to resell on the Poshmark platform. Got it? So my numbers may look really low, but it actually sold for much higher. Remember that item sold for $10. All right, so forgive the sound. If you can hear the mower in the background, I've got yard work going on. And so... Um, the next item that I'm going to share with you is the, um, I've got a pair of really soft, um, new without tags, black leggings, and those I paid a dollar for out of a liquidation box, trying to scroll to my spot here, a dollar for them out of a liquidation box. And then um, they sold for $6, but my earnings were $3 and five cents. So two oh five is my profit there. Remember, this is profit sales for the last two days. The next thing I have is a five pack of sexy underwear. So this is a really good idea. If you've got a lot of things that are all the same size, but maybe won't sell individually on their own, put them in your own type of bundle. So this is a five pack of sexy underwear and I put styles may vary since I had a lot of different kinds, a size large. Um, my earnings were 605. I've got about a dollar invested. So I'm at $5 and five cents. Then the next item I have is a pair of de designed by Dolce Vita, really, really cute wedge heels. They look just like that, super adorable. I do have another pair of those in size seven. My earnings were $14.20. They came from a Via Trady um, liquidation palette of which I paid $4 a piece per each pair. So $14.20 minus my four is $10 and 20 cents when we get done with these two days worth of sales i'm going to go ahead and package everything up give you a total and let you know how much did i sell and how many orders did i actually have the next thing that i have is a pair of mad love adama multi-strap thong sandals seven dollars and 25 cents is what i paid those i actually got out of a bulk box of which i paid about two dollars for them so 7.25 minus my two is 5.25 for profits. Then I have a pair, a really cute pair of Cat and Jack sneakers for little boys. I had these in a smaller size and I got them in a size 10. Aren't they cute? They're adorable. Little Velcro ones, they have stars on the inside. Very, very adorable. So I paid $4 as well for those because they came out of the same palette as those Dolce, Vig Dolce Vita ones. And so $4 is what I paid for them. Six oh five is what I earned. So 205 are my actual profit. So I made all my money back plus an additional 205. Then I've got a Gilligan and O'Malley pajama top. A dollar is what I paid out of a liquidation palette for that. 905 is what I earned. So 805 are my profits there. Then I've got a pair of a New Day high rise flare dress pants. Um, 625 are my earnings. They actually sold for 11. So $6.25 is what I earned. $2 is what I paid out of a liquidation box. So $4.25 for profits there. Then we're gonna wander back down on this side. Now I have been selling a ton of these. Sometimes I break even and sometimes I barely make money at all. So these are a pair of waterproof uh, women's Chelsea rain boots, size seven. 705 is what I earned. And unfortunately I made a bad purchase and spent too much money on these and bought two pallets of very similar shoes. So I actually paid seven bucks for those. So my pro actual profit is five cents 
So if I went through, if you watch uh, the previous Poshmark video, which I'll try to tag at the end of this one, um, I actually went through sales numbers in one column and then profit numbers, which is what I'm writing down here in another column, so that you could see the difference and kind of make the comparison in your own store. Um, so just be aware of that. This is a foam wire-free bra um, amethyst with polka dots, 42E. Um, I paid a dollar out of a liquidation box, 405 is what I earned, so I'm at three. 05 for my actual profits. Then I've got a beautiful women's blouse with really cute floral pattern. 925 is what I earned. $2 is what I paid out of a liquidation. So 725 on that. Then I've got another pair of those Cat and Jack Velcro kids shoes that I showed you earlier. $4.25 is what I earned. $4 is what I paid. So I'm at 25 cents of total profit. Sorry about the lawnmower noise if you can hear it. All right, then I have a bundle of, if you've ever watched any of my Poshmark sales, you know that I love bundles. Bundles are great for the customer because they get less to pay in shipping. And then I also make more money per item on each bundle because I'm not paying as high a fees selling them individually. So I've got these really cute, a new day Esperilla slide sandals with wedge heels. Those sold for $25. And then this Joy Lab Fun Relax Fit Athletic shirt sold for $16. After all of the fees and everything, $20 is what I earned. And so I have $4 invested here, $2 invested there so for a total of $6 of investment in this bundle, which makes my profit $14 total. I tried to write 15. I'm trying to give myself an extra dollar. All right. Then I've got a really cute Wild Fable overalls. They're kind of a distressed style. $16 is what I earned on that. $3 is what I paid. So I'm at $13 of profit. And that also came out of a really nice liquidation box. Then I've got another bundle. Um, this is these I've had on here forever, so I'm shocked that I even sold them. I was getting ready to actually unlist them, so somebody got themselves a deal. This is a pair of Dana Buckman Petite Extra Large Slimming Pull-On Pants, and these are also a pair of Comfort Waist Extra Large Pull-On Capris. They're really cute striped ones. My earnings were $7.25. I have $2 each invested for a total of $4, so $3.25 are my profits on that. We're gonna wander back down here. Do you remember how I said I had that cool rubber boot that I sold? Well, here's another one that I just sold. They sold for a little bit less, I think. Nope, exact same amount. And so they sold, I earned, for $10, I earned 7.05. I paid seven for a total of five cents of profit on those. Now, you may be thinking, why only make five cents of profit? Well, I have a ton of these still left over and I'm really trying to get them moved so that I'm not sharing them so much at my Poshmark store because I really just didn't make a wise buy. And that happens to the best of us. I'll be smarter next time. All right, this is a pair, five pairs of hip, hipster panties. $2.25 is what I earned. A dollar is what I paid. So I'm at a dollar twenty-five of profit on underwear. I'll take it make my money back plus a buck 25. All right, then I have an exhilaration, really cute navy blue striped some jumpsuit. 15.20 is what I earned and $2 is what I paid out of an ex out of a I almost said exhilaration, that's the brand. Out of a liquidation box, so I'm at 13 20 for my profit. Stay tuned. I will add everything up at the end and see how many orders I have total for two days of sales on Poshmark. Then I got this really cute lace razorback bra sunset orange underwear 36E or double D. Um, $1.25 is what I earned. A dollar is what I paid. So I'm at 25 cents of profit on that orange bra. And that came out of a liquidation palette with tons of intimates in it. Then I've got this really cool pair. I've actually got a couple more pair of these. So if you're interested, go ahead and check them out. This is a size 10 and a half academics leather loafer uh, for men. Really cute kind of plaid detail on the inside that came out of a liquidation box that I got from bulk.com. Um, and I think it's a Target brand. So I paid about $2 for them. And let's see what I earned. My earnings are actually $12. So $10 
are my profits on one pair of shoes. So it all kind of equals out because some people may come looking for the bra where you only make 25 cents and then buy the shoes where you only, where you get to make $10. So just make sure that you have a wide variety of things on your store to attract a lot of customers. The last thing that I have for sale on these two days worth of sales on Posh is a pair of flat ballet, Massimo ballet flats. I like to say ballet twice, evidently. Women's scrunch black ballet flats. I've got more of these if you're interested. Eight and a half is what the size is on this one. $15 is what they sold for. I earned $12 off of that sale and I paid $4 from via trading liquidation of assorted shoes. And so $8 total are my profits there. So that is all of the sales for these last two days. Stay tuned. I'll always put out my sales for two days so that I can get this all shipped out to my customer, but I'm going to add it all up, tell you how many orders it is total and bring you back the profits. All right, we've got everything added up. It came to $113.75 for two days of sales on Poshmark for a total of 21 separate orders. So that's a really, really great day for me. Um, I'm really enjoying in that. Remember, that is a profit number, not a sales number. The sales number is usually about double to three times what that is. Hopefully it's been helpful to see what I sold these last two days on Poshmark. And remember in the end, Jesus wins. You guys are true blessing in my life. Thank you so much for helping me put this content out there to everyone. If you'd like to join these great people, please consider supporting me through my Patreon page. Check the link below. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. If you'd like to watch more of my videos, just click on them here. And if you'd like to learn more about the reseller world, subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. Thanks.